In this video, we're going to look at how we can create a really quick merge queue presentation using CoSpaces EDU. And we're going to cover some of the basics that you can see are listed here. We're also going to be adding text and attaching an image and a video to a cube. So let's go over to CoSpaces EDU. And over here, I've just um, turned on. So you can see here it says top, front, left, right. And that's because I've turned on side labels. And that's really useful by giving you a point of reference on the cube. So I recommend having that on. Also, don't forget, click over here to name your cube. And if we do a two finger click or a right mouse click, depending on what you're using, you can also view inside. Now, view inside gives you the option of posting your content on the inside of your cube as opposed to the outside, uh, depending on what the content actually is. And here in material, then you can choose the texture and the color of your cube. It also gives you the option of changing the opacity. So I'm gonna have the opacity turned up to 100%, but you don't necessarily have to have it turned up to 100%. And now let's see if we can attach a video and an image to the cube. So I've uploaded an image and I've uploaded a video. I'm gonna drag the video out and click on V, and that will zoom in there. And if I just rotate round, you can see that's a miniature of the video. And if I double click on here, it gives me some options, and I'm going to attach it. Now, let's click on V again. That centers it. And if I click on here, so this option here, you can click and drag, and I can make that screen. So it fits on one of the, the sides of the cube. You can't unfortunately crop, which would be a nice feature. So you could fit all of it onto the side of the cube. There's always going to be some gaps. So we've put on a video. Now we'll follow the same process, but add an image. So double click, attach. There is a shortcut for this. You could just press A and increase the size. So, so far, we have got an image on the left-hand side here. We've got a video on the back. And we could, if we wanted, to also add some text. So if you go into Text Marker, zoom in there, double-click, click on Text. And then zoom out a bit so we can see the cube. Click A, which is the shortcut for attach, and V, and you can add text. Now, once it's attached, when we if we go to unlock, you can actually move the cube, and the content will stay on the cube. In the next video, I'm going to show you how you can bring your cube to life and actually get your videos to come on as people look at them.